I'm Mike Moore. I'm the chief of Rapids Volunteer Fire Company. Uh, we serve the town of Lockport, and this is where this light rescue is going to be going home today. It's a F550 Ford chassis. We went with the F550 XLT package for crew comfort and space. Compartment one here, we have our on scene solution cargo slides. Pull through compartment, we'll be equipped with five SCBAs, extrication tools, and fire extinguishers. Below that, we have wheel chocks, be other miscellaneous equipment. Our second compartment here, we have a charging bank for the Streamlight Survivor lights, two box lights by Streamlight, and a leaf blower for extrication vehicle cleanup. And when we get back to the department, we will be putting in um, water rescue suits and a rope rescue bag set up. The rear compartment here, we have our extrication tool set up. This is a Homaltro Pantheon combination tool with the um, tilt tilt mount on it for easy grab and go access to our extrication equipment. The spare battery charging bank, there will be other extrication tools going in here as well. In the rear compartment here, we have a spot for a Stokes basket, four pike poles, and then this slide out compartment, we're going to have a calf system. It's a 10 gallon tank that runs off a 4500 SCBA bottle for uh, putting out car fires with foam. In the passenger rear compartment, we've got storage space for extra cribbing, for chalking vehicles, for extrication, as well as a Warren winch that we can pull out and attach to the front or rear hitch mounts. In the passenger middle compartment, this is gonna be dedicated to our EMS supplies. It'll have a jump bag and oxygen for any EMS related situations that we get ourselves into with this vehicle. This is the other side of the transverse compartment. Um, this will have some of the SCBAs on this side, the fire extinguisher, and more extrication tools. Up front, we have a custom bumper with the pitch receiver for the, the Warren winch, as well as hookup points for the rope. Thank you, SVI, for this awesome truck. Can't wait to get it back and get it in service.